So I want to do a quick video on how to wear motorhome using the rake weight control toy. Um, I've been had my eye on this for a while because there's no way of knowing really how heavy or loaded you are, both for total weight of 3,500 3, kilograms and also on your front and back axles, which potentially you could get stopped for at any time. So um, I had my eye on this and it's, it's basically a German made device where you use Effectively, it's a portable weigh bridge. So the idea is that it has two weight sensors on the back side, and you put it on the floor and you drive over it and it weighs each wheel. And then by flicking through on these buttons, you can then weigh all four wheels and get a total weight for the vehicle. And also you can work out your front and back loadings against your plated weight. So I just run through the buttons first and then we'll weigh the van. Okay, so there are basically three buttons on the device. The first is the on-off button, which turns the panel on. The second two, if you push them both together, you can swap vehicle or type. So that's a caravan, uh, that's a motorhome, and that's a twin axle caravan. So I'm only interested in the motorhome. So then this button next toggles between each wheel. So you can see it's flashing front left. So therefore you weigh that wheel. And when, when you've done that, you do the back left, front right, back right. And when you've done them, then total We'll give you a figure. So let's run through that now. So I pop that under the wheel, and then I just roll over it. I'm going to push next. Beat the other side. Okay, so I've just finished doing the weighing. So I've got my front right 627, back right 743, front left 632, back left 657. And then if I push total, I get the left side total is 1389 kilograms. The right side total is 1,370 and the overall weight for the vehicle is 2,760 which is pretty much what I'd expect because this correlates with the figures I get from the manufacturer. Also I've also weighed my car and the weight for that also tallies pretty much exactly what I'd expect. They claim a 3% accuracy so I certainly think that's believable and at least that means you've got some confidence that when you load or when you're travelling you can tell both your, your total weight is under the limit but also you can unfortunately have to add up the rear and front using the uh, individual figures so I can see for that I've got 632 and 627 so you can add them up and that gives you a front total and then your rear is 743 and 757 now they're well under my rear axle and front axle limits but it's annoying that it doesn't give you a total for the front and back as well as left and right but it's still a useful toy